Hey guys, we are going to open another one of these $10 boxes to see what we have. And right off the bat, I see some legends, probably not any really good ones. Visions is okay. Oh, these are foreign cards. Black border as usual, Tundra, one of my favorite pictures. The artwork on these cards are just fantastic and they can't really be duplicated nowadays because some people might find it offensive. Like, I don't find these offensive. This is just how magic was. Oh, and we have a Legends. I believe this used to be a rare or uncommon and we have a whole set of them. So we have blue, 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 white, red, and green. And some more Moss Monster, one of my favorite ones. This is what we used to play with. This used to be considered very good, as was Panther Warrior. Volcanic, Pack, Urza Chalice, Dragon Engine. Typically, oh, and then we get to Homelands. Lots and lots of Homelands, it looks like. So maybe we'll find some Norwales. But it looks like this is Homelands White. Yes, lots and lots. Uh, whatever card you want in Homelands, there are many, many of them here. But it looks like it's generally white. Well, actually, it's not just Homelands anymore. There's, like, this type of stuff, you just want to see. Like, you, you're not going to see it anymore. Sarah's Paladin, so bad. These cards are so bad that, and there's, like, a bazillion of them. If you hit, go, oh, Trade Caravan. Oh, that's not as good as I thought it was. If you hit like a good card from one of these, you're gonna hit a jackpot. But that being said, they probably are just bulk and they've been bulk this way for a long time. Ooh, Visions, so that is, these charms, like Holy Charm, like any of these charms are worth, it's just, it smells pretty fresh, like out of the pack. I feel like they just opened a ton of packs and Panther Warriors back in the day was OP. It was like the best card. Giant Caterpillar, this card used to be good, although it's like double the price of Regrowth, which is not even, oh, Original Fog. No, this is not Original Fog, but from Miraz. Hyenas, Elephants, I do miss, oh, another Fog. The Fog is probably worth like a few cents. Ooh, a Serpent, is this a good one? Nope. The Crocodile, I remember this Crocodile, 6-5 were phasing for five. That was considered very, very good at the time. Dream Fighter, Drake, and Tiger. So, I don't expect to find too much stuff, but again, drafting. So drafting, you can pay $10 or 15. So at my local card center, it's $15 to draft, and you just get bulk anyway, but you're not gonna get, I'm pretty sure this is a rare or uncommon. I, I do like the lion a lot, hyenas, elephants. I mean, I mean, you can make a tribal animal deck using these. Oh, this is a good card. A lot of those. I do like the fact it is organized. I don't have the ability to organize like this. Although you can't, rampant growth, yeah. Still sees play today. EDH card. Ooh, I'm pretty sure this is a lead. This is a rare because just because it's a legend, but it's no good. It's phasing and trample. Like you can find legends here. Seed of Innocence. Just bury all, all artifacts. Each artifact controller gains an amount equal to the artifacts to that artifact's casting cost. Pretty good. I mean, bury all artifacts for one and double green. Are these the rares? Discordant spirit. I don't know, but they're still not worth like a tremendous lot amount of money. Reign of Terror, this one's very good. It's bury all white creatures and then bury all green creatures. Lose two life for each creature put in a graveyard this way. So you're playing a Selesnia deck and EDH maybe. Pretty, pretty OP. For Tog. I mean, you can't just, you can't buy these anymore. Not for $10. Fire Whip, a bazillion Fire Whips. Um, yeah, it's not bad. Fit a Rage. Orcs, when orcs still use Samite's Blessing. Because of EDH, there is a possibility some of these are worth more money than I believe they are worth. Are worth more than bulk. Phantom, I mean Phantom Master, Monster. You can't make this up. I'm pretty sure this Justice is a rare school to Unseen. 
from my lines. It's not the right one. I'm hoping to hit that one from the dark. It looks like we're hitting the dark now. And the land has gone up a lot in price. Ooh, legends. We're, and they're different languages. Monster de Musho. Wirecat, Pit Trap, Oki okay, Stern, Exhaustin. This card, the turnabout is worth money, but not Exhaustin. And now we get some uncommons, which is good. Spreading Algae. So we need the other, we need the uncommon that we can, that is for islands, right? That one is worth money. That one's worth like 10 bucks. Unfortunately, I don't think I found anything worth uh, more than a dollar or 50 cents or even a quarter here so far. But it is a lot of fun to, this card used to be really fun to play with. I loved it. And there's an infinite combo for it. Interdict. Okay. Anella Abduxin, of course, because you can't have enough. I'm pretty sure this is a rare. These, like, ter like they were just so terrible back in the day. Like, rares were just very, very bad. Um, it is fun. It's so much fun doing this. Archer, Spike Colony, not the correct Spike. I think Sp Spino Worm. Crystal Golem. Okay, we're getting to some interesting cards that I haven't seen. Ice Float, School of the Unseen, we don't need that. We need the other one from the dark. Uh, remember like they call lands Karoo? These are why they call them the Karoo lands when they bounce up and return back to your hand. And I'm looking for a dark Liches, Citro. Ooh, I love this card from Unglued. I wish they would print another Unglued would be pretty cool. Visions from Fourth, I believe. Wall of Stone, Tro, Tunnel, not much going on here. Very old school is hum Homeland. And let's finish off with the rest of it. Oof. Okay, that's... This is like so much more random than a booster box of cards because you get them from all different series. Obviously the value is not there, but all you need to do is hit one time, right? All you have to do is hit one. Oh, Flash Fire is not too bad. Firefly, after that great movie or TV show. Truce from Homeland. So it looks like they're really into Homelands in this set. And Peace of Mind. Nah, Peace of Mind's not too bad. Discard Outlet. Kismet Karma. Mana Breach. Life Tap. Not the right one that we're trying to look for at this time. <laughs> Hammerid, Crumble, Cocoon, Bounty of the Hunt. Okay, cool. Maybe we'll, maybe some of them have Force of Will. Probably not because even back, even for a long time, Force of Will was recognized as a very, very good card. Winter Blast, Banshee, and Enchant Artication. This one might be worth money. I remember, I vaguely remember that it could be. Juxtapose used to be worth money. I don't know if that's true. All right, last few last few cards. Mox Diamonds, not bad. It's a very beautiful diamond. It's not a Mox, oh, not Mox Diamond, Marble Diamond. Drought, Conversion, here's some hate cards. Blue, <laughs> Abu Jafar, not from original Arabian Nights. This used to be one of the best cards. I remember in one of the dual decks, back in the day, there was dual decks and they came out with this really cool box. It was like before fat packs, but it was pretty cool. Hurricane, which is a rare, so it is possible for us to see. Warmth used to be very good. This addition of Karma, which is not widely out there. This card, Ranger of Vex, so not, and Okay, Bad River, I believe this is worth like two bucks. Um, I'm not sure why it is worth that amount of money, but it is worth a lot of money um, because for ED8s, they don't really care about the quality of the land. It's just that it is older. So it comes in play tap, but other than that, it is uh, put that land into play. Other than this, other the fact that the land comes in play tapped and you can't really fetch something, your next turn, you can go ahead and fetch something and it can come in play untapped. So it is pretty good. Uh, you can search for an island or swamp. Obviously you can also search for a dual land. I'm hoping to get a few more of these. So I'm gonna put this to a side and 
Wish me luck. Bye, guys.